check me out. Today, um, today I want to do one to the young niggas, man. Uh, and this is my, this is this is where I'm coming from. In the in the past week, I've talked to four different young dudes, four different young dudes. Um, and those aren't even all the guys I've talked to before or I talked to. Uh, but anyways, there are a few central points that kept coming up that that I think, you know, because I because I gave the niggas game. I don't mind, you know, so I'm, I'm going to put the game on here because I, 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 it talking to those four showed me how pertinent it is to to not to not think that this goes without saying. So I don't want to think that this goes without saying. And so I'm going to say, it, OK, this is so this is why I'm, I'm speaking to the young dudes on this. And I'll probably try and reiterate this throughout the video. But the advice that I would give to a young dude is not the advice I would give to a young lady. Not at all. Not at all. Not at all. Not at all. To the degree to which I'm going to tell young niggas to go out there and get that thing. A girl, I would say, yo, if you if you ever going to want family in your life, do it young. And then, and then do all those other things you want to do with your husband. Anyways, for the young dude. Right, if you, if you in this motherfucker, you ain't got, like, school, some, some kind of obligation that's going to keep you here for the next two or three years, bro, get the fuck on. Get you a passport and get the fuck on at least once. At least once. Like, for real. You gotta get you gotta get the fuck out of here. The, the, the planet is global at this point, yo. It's global. It's fucking global. If you're here, it's because you're choosing to be. Period. You could, bro. There's so many things you could do. There's so many places you could do. If you if you if you're between the ages of 18 and 30, bro, you got time. No, I'd say 18 and 28. By the time you're 28, you need to already be thinking about 30 for real, though. Uh, but between 18 and 28, bro, you got time. You got hella time. You got a lot of fucking time. But I know when I was when I was fucking 21, 22, and I went to fucking Mexico, like I was down there for nine months, bro. That shit was wonderful. And I would have I would have stayed longer if I hadn't if I hadn't have thought. Not even just necessarily thought. If I hadn't realized that I missed some things. Um, which leads me to my second point. You know, the first point is get the fuck out of here, man. Get the fuck out of here. If there's nothing holding you down, why would you be here? Go fuck around and find out, bro. Like, like that's the thing. Risk texting an L and get out here and see what you can do. Go somewhere you've never gone to for a year. Do something you've never done. And all in the effort of figuring out what it is you want to do in life, okay? But see, the thing is, like I've said before, males and females have different... Um, different goals in life because a female is born, is born with her intrinsic value her goal is to maintain it because a male is not born with any he has to go make it you have to build something with that being said you don't have to use the scope of the place you're in now get the fuck on man get the like pack up and go it ain't like you got much to fucking pack anyway the second point and this has to do with family, more especially your mom. All right? Like with the guys with the single mom and your mom, she don't have, she, she doesn't have a man in her life, regardless of whether or not that is she chose or, or didn't. You don't want to, especially if you're a young man, you don't want to get just stuck in the son husband thing. You don't. You don't. Your parents made their choices. You need to make yours. Your parents, man, as much as you would like to think motherfuckers wouldn't throw you out, abandon you, or whatever, they would. They would. And it's not personal. It's not personal. So yeah, get the fuck out of here. And don't, don't, don't end up, but don't stay because you want to be a son husband. Everybody gotta deal with their choices. That includes your mom. That's not your choice, it's not your burden, it's not your obligation family in general bro it'll it, it's, a, it's a head trip sometimes so yeah get the fuck on man get the fuck out of here do go do whatever like fuck around and find out i cannot stress it enough it's not advice for girls it's advice for dudes especially the young dudes that's all i have to say i gotta make this into a video bro fuck